Today, I went on a shopping spree at Olifyeong. Today, I went to Olifyeong, a popular health and beauty drugstore in Korea and bought nine of the best selling products they have. So what are the best current top nine selling products that they carry? They are Eye Soy Bulgaria Rose Blemish Care Serum, Dr. G's Green Mild Up Sun Cream, the Bioderma Sensi Bio H2O Cleansing Water, the Clinic Chick Pop On The Glow Trio Palette, the Medihill Tea Tree Mask Pack, the Good Old Green Tangerines Vita C Dark Spot Serum, Dr. G's Red Blemish Clear Soothing Cream, Physiogel DMT Facial Cream, and Kate Powdery Skin Maker. First product, I got is the Isoy Bulgarian Rose Blemish Care Serum. This is currently the number one selling product at Olive Young for six consecutive years, and it's really famous for its blemish care fact. Before introducing the serum, let me show you the package first. When taking out the products, you can see there are many products included in this package. There's Bulgarian Rose Blemish Mask Pack, three samples of Bulgarian Rose Blemish Skin Toner, and Bulgarian Rose Blemish Serum in a small bottle. The serum has a clear jelly-like formulation that is slightly diluted in terms of viscosity. At first, I thought it would be heavy and sticky, but it's actually really light and fresh. A lot of people claim to have seen great improvements with their skin as it works to lighten and to remove blemishes. I also have some spots on my face, so I'm looking forward to see how this product works for me. Next up is Dr. G's Green Mild Up Sun Cream. This is actually a sun cream that I've been using with my day-to-day -day care routine. And I also covered it in my previous day care routine video. This cream has a bit watery texture, so when applying it, it feels light, very moisturizing, and it doesn't have any white residue. I bought this today because I actually finished using up the one I had. I'll put the link for that video up here and down in the description. Looking at the list of ingredients, I could see Urban Environmental Protection Complexes. Glycofilm for urban environmental protection, panthenol to help strengthen skin barrier, and fignogenol for skincare. Fignogenol is the only ingredient extracted from the pine trees that overcame the rough sea breeze and hot sun on the French coast. And there's also ingredients for calming effects such as Nutella Asiatica extract and sunflower seed oil. Also, this product is proven to have a blue light blocking effect. I actually have mentioned that I prefer stick type sun care products than cream types. But when using this, I was surprised to find that it was really light and fresh and it didn't feel sticky on my hand at all. The third thing I got is the Bioderma Sensi Bio H2O Cleansing Water. This is also very popular. I remember having used it a few times a while back ago. This also has 500 milliliters of cleansing water with the 250 milliliters of cleansing water included in the package. It sure contains a lot. As you guys know, this has a watery texture and I could feel that it smoothly cleans my skin. Five of the 10 essential minerals needed for skin are skin barrier enhancers and this cleansing water contains all five of them. This is an acidic and light cleansing water, so it'll be great for all skin types, especially for sensitive and oily skin. The fourth product I have here is the Clinique Cheek Pop on the Glow Trio Palette. Recently, I've been using these blushers whenever I do my makeup because the colors are so pretty. I actually have the blusher right now. This palette has three colors. From here, it's Pearl Pop, Melon Pop, and Sorbet Pop. First, Pearl Pop has a warm feeling of pink beige with gold pearl. When applying it on, the pearl isn't too much. It looks very natural, so I think it'll look great with natural makeup. Also, this color looks especially great in under natural light, so it can be used as a highlighter. The second color, Melon Pop, has a lovely pink curl color. Personally, I think it'll be great when you want a lively pink makeup. This color is actually quite light, so I think it'll be great in the summer season. This is actually the color I'm using it right now. Last color, Sorbet Pop, has a bit of a yellowish peach coral color. I think this color will be great for warm tone makeup, and I find that when applied lightly, it gives off a very, very innocent look. And when you put it on a lot, it looks very cute. The fifth product I have here is the Medihill Tea Tree Mask Pack. I think most of you guys also know this product since BTS has been advertising this mask pack and is also awarded the first place in the 2018 Beauty Award mask pack. I've been consistently using this mask pack for quite a long time because I choose to only use the products that contain tea tree extract. When taking out the mask packs out of the box, you can see that there are six mask packs inside. But I have five of it because I already used one. This mask pack's essence is really light, moisturizing, and makes my skin feel calm. The sixth product here is the Goodles Green Tangerine Vada Dark Spot Serum. 
This is also great for blemishes like the Isoe Blemish Care Serum. This package includes 10 milliliters of serum and cream inside. This serum comes in a way pumped type bottle, so it's really convenient to use. When pumping it out on the back of my hand, you can see that it has a gel type texture, it feels really light and moisturizing. But I found that if you apply it too much on, it can feel a bit sticky, so I recommend you to apply it on little by little in layers. This serum contains 70% of tangerine extract, which makes your skin lively and energetic. It also has a slight citrus scent because of the tangerine extract. Lots of people said they also saw and felt the effect after using it for two weeks. So I'm really looking forward to using the serum. The lucky seventh product is the Dr. G's Red Blemish Clear Soothing Cream. This is another product I reviewed previously in my other videos, so I'll just speak briefly. The cream has a light texture and is watery like soothing gel. When looking at the package, we can see that there's a soothing cream and also it contains 30 milliliters of soothing cream. If you're curious about the full review of this product, I'll put the link up here and down in the description. The eighth product I have here is the Physiogel DMT Facial Cream. I was surprised with this package. When opening the box, there's 150 milliliters of facial cream and there are five really cute small 10 milliliters of facial creams. Aren't they so adorable? This cream is extremely moisturizing so it can feel a bit thick. A lot of people with super dry skin around me swear by this cream stating that it is highly moisturizing for their skin. This cream maintains moisture up to 72 hours, it's acidic, and has completed non-comedogenic tests. If you're someone with oily skin, you might find it to be a bit heavy, but if you're someone with dry skin, you gotta try this out. Lastly, I got my hand on the Kate Powdery Skin Maker. This is also known as 15 Second Foundation, and it's actually the number one product for 16 consecutive years among the self-makeup brands in Japan. I have two colors, number six light pink and number one ivory. Well, there's many colors, but I bought two colors, which I think is the representative 21 and 23. I think number one fits me well since I use 23, so let me apply it on my face. When first applying it, it feels really moisturizing, but after 15 minutes, it finishes up with a powdery feeling. It also has a higher coverage than I expected, so I'm quite fond of this foundation. So this was my top 9 best-selling products from Olive Young. There were some products I'm really looking forward to. What do you guys think? I'm also curious about the popular products in your country. Let me know down below. Thank you for watching my video today. Don't forget to subscribe, press the like buttons, and please leave some comments for me. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!